Hello friends, welcome to House of Apps English. In this video, I'm going to show you how to transfer money from HDFC Net Banking. So if you don't know the full process, watch this video till end and you'll get to know. Now before starting the video, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Now guys, I'm showing this process on my laptop, but if you're using a mobile phone, then you can follow the same process as it is. First of all, you need to open a browser and search for HDFC Net Banking. Select HDFC Bank Net Banking link over here and it will take you to login page. Over here, you can enter your login credentials to complete the login process. Now, once the login is complete, it will take you to the home page. Now, currently we are on accounts page over here, but in order to transfer money, we need to select fund transfer option. Now, once you go to fund transfer option, uh, later on, you need to select the transaction type over here. So let's say if you want to transfer a money to a person whose bank account is in HDFC bank, you can select this first option, which says transfer within the bank. Now, the second thing is if you're transferring money to a person whose bank account is not in HDFC bank, uh, they have some other bank, then you can select the second option, which is instant transfer for other bank account. So select go option over here. But before getting to the next page, let me tell you one thing that you need to add beneficiary account first in order to transfer the money. Now, if you have not done that, you can go to fund transfer page. Under request, you will find an option to add a beneficiary account. You can add the bank details of the person to whom you want to transfer the money. And after half an hour, you can start doing the transaction. So yeah, let's start uh, with that. Uh, let's select the second option of IMPS. Now it will take us to the next page. And over here, there are three steps. On the first step, you need to select your bank account. So select this drop down, select your bank. And in beneficiary, you need to select the account which you have added. You can see now it is showing me three options because I have already added the beneficiary account uh, in my HDFC net banking. So I'm going to select this first name over here. And as soon as I select the name, you can see account details has popped up automatically. So I don't have to enter the details for now because I have already added the beneficiary account details. Now, the next thing is you need to enter the amount which you want to transfer. You can add remarks if you want to. Don't forget to check this box. And once you do everything, just select continue option. Now, once you select continue option, it will take us to a second step, which is uh, you need to confirm the transaction. Uh, so you can confirm the account details. You can confirm the beneficiary account details over here. You can confirm the amount. And once everything is done, go down and select confirm option. Now on the next page, it will ask us to uh, select an option to send OTP. So either you can receive OTP on your register email ID or else on mobile number. In my case, I'm going to select mobile number. Once you select the detail, select continue option. Now you will receive an OTP on the selected option. I have selected mobile number. So I have, I have already received an OTP on my mobile number. So I'm going to enter the OTP and I'm going to select continue. So I have entered the OTP. Let's select continue option. And now you can see transaction is complete. If you want to check out the details, you can check out the reference number over here. You can check out the transaction ID over here. So this is how simple it is to transfer money from HDFC net banking. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, then don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.